I'm already dreading it. I'm already hurting you. Hey guys, Foxy here. And well, I'm with my main humans, Hunter and Lexi. <laughs> today, we are checking out, today, we are checking out more San Francisco coffee shops. With our first video of the year, we had to start it off with a coffee review. Today, we are headed to, okay, my human is gonna tell us, oh, okay. Today, we're headed to Sight Glass. We've heard so many great things about it, and now we are just excited to go and check it out. Coffee chasers, here we go. All right, so we walked to Sight Glass, and it was closed. A lot of businesses are taking big breaks for the holiday season because it's hard right now to like keep your business open, even just keeping the lights on, costing them money, and if, not enough people are coming in, you know, it just doesn't make sense for them. So I get it, I'm a little disappointed. I really wanted to check out Sight Glass. Although I've been there before, but I was excited for Hunter to try them out. Yeah, we walked all the way over here. We risked it, watch out, for no biscuit. <laughs> so yeah, this is probably the fourth coffee shop that we've tried outside of Coffee Movement. We normally go to Coffee Movement every day. And every time we veer away from the movement, it like brings us back. It's just not as a pleasant of a walk experience the whole shebang so we're I think it's just been bad luck you know we gotta you have to try different things and stuff and the coffee movement is great and there's unique things that you find on every journey so we're gonna continue to explore it's just been a little bit of a tough luck lately it just gets a little stressful so now this video has turned into a day in the life of and i just thought i'd run you guys on it's january 3rd we're gonna make coffee at home and we got a lot of good coffee in the mail, so I think we should try one of those and review those. Right. <laughs> Homebrewed coffee reviewed. I guess we can segue this into resolutions and like what we're trying to do this year. Hunter, what kind of resolutions, what are you looking to take into 21? 2021, I just want to work on balance. I want to be healthy. I want to be, I just want to have like a balanced regimen. I want to play. I want to work. I want to grow. So. Obviously this is a transition year for me, so I just wanna not try to do too much all at once. I wanna just, yeah, basically just be balanced. Mine are a little bit more specific. Mine's like, I need to drink more water. I want to grow Pineapple Labs a little bit more. You know, one goal that I'm trying to do is have a Pineapple Labs pop-up shop. In terms of location, when and where, all TBD. I'm trying to do that. Let's see if that happens. I don't feel too hot about like my body right now and like how I feel health-wise. So I'm trying to clean that all up in the new year. I'm usually really good about it, but for whatever reason, the holidays this year and just with the pandemic, I don't feel so great, you know? Yeah, that's kind of it mainly. Drink more water, get healthy, get balanced, grow the brands as much as I can, but also continuing to like do things that I enjoy. The one thing I will take from 2020 is the slowing down part. I really enjoyed that. That's definitely been an adjustment. So I'm gonna try and take that into 2021. What are you gonna do for 2021? Play with more dogs? Now we're walking home. I'll see you guys when we get home. We're both a little wah wah. But then we'll go home, we'll have some coffee and we'll be back to our perky happy selves. All right guys, so we stopped off at Phil's. Hunter said he was gonna brew coffee at home. I was like, I can't wait any longer. I need the coffee. And it's on our now. walk back, and there's a burrito here. I'm interested to check out the burrito. I it's mean, burrito. let's talk about what time it is and that we haven't had coffee or breakfast. It's 1.30. It looks like 8.30. And tomorrow we have to be up at what time in the morning? We have to, okay, so tomorrow Fox is getting her lady surgery, and we have to drop her off between 7.30 and 8.30. We had to get up so early. We slept in until like 10 today. We didn't leave the house till 12. There, there you have it, you guys. We didn't go to bed late though, did we? No, we went to bed. Well, we're watching The Hobbit. We didn't go to bed till like midnight, I think. We're just 10 hour sleepers. We need a lot of sleep. Right, Fox? Right, Foxinator? What are you looking at? We should just do videos on just Foxy and what she does. <laughs> She's pretty interesting. She's pretty cool. So I'm already not starting out so well having a breakfast burrito and a coffee with a lot tomorrow, of sugar in it. <laughs> tomorrow, the cleanse begins. Tomorrow we're doing a cleanse. We're doing a three week 
cleanse, 21 days. It's called from the clean program. I've done it once before, my friend Eki told me about it. And I felt really good on it. It's just a good way to just kind of like reset. But you know when you want something so bad that you visualize it and it almost like changes the words just so it says what you want it to say? I feel like that's ours. You're, you're in that trance where you're like, I just need coffee. I just need coffee. I just need coffee. All right. These bandits are out. Yeah. They look like bandits. I need to pull my life together. Look at this. I, I look like, this is my most favorite jacket right now, and it's not flattering on me. Also, these sweats that I'm wearing, also Don't not be flattering. Don't so hard on yourself. I look like I have shloopy butt. Oh, come on. I do. It's fine, whatever. We'll see when we get home. Hopefully I can pull this together. So we just got home, we ate our burritos, and they were good. We've decided they are Neutral. They get the job done, but you don't really want to eat them every day. They get the job done, but you don't want to eat them every day. We were supposed to go for a hike, but the weather was kind of crummy, so we didn't. So, because we were supposed to spend time last night, but Hunter got into gaming a little too much yesterday. And so, we didn't get to spend last night together. So today, we were supposed to spend time together. But I was like, look, I promised you that you could stream today. So we I'll spent, sacrifice. We spent all the way to like 5.30 yesterday, yeah. Sacrifice my time with you and you can stream, but you have to spend the morning with me. After we ate, we had our coffee, I was like, okay, you are released. And the look on his face was so happy. I was like, can you please at least try to look sad about leaving me and going to game into your virtual world? <laughs> The game is only fun because I have a wonderful wife who I love so much. <laughs> like, you know, when, when I leave the game, then I get to cuddle and be with my lovely, wonderful wife who I feel like I can be fulfilled and satisfied. But you can't game if you're like single and lonely and don't have those <laughs> wonderful partners. But when you have both, it's the best. So he's gonna go game and stream, which you guys, if you guys haven't checked out his stream, be sure to check it out, twitch.tv forward slash Hunter Pence. There's a comedian that I've been wanting to check out on Netflix, and I'm gonna watch them drink my coffee, a little early afternoon giggle. Sam J something at 3 a.m., but I'm gonna check her out. Now that I have a coffee, I'm like, okay, let's, let's vlog, let's talk. Mm. Can you tell what kind of coffee drink I get at Phil's? I get the mint, ice mint mojito. Hunter, what did you get? <laughs> Cozy with a cup of gratitude? Yeah, it was actually pretty good. He loved it. We don't order from Phil's often, but when we do, we love it. I wanted to like plan out the week, so I have three days. <clears throat> Mal comes in tomorrow, I have three days with her till she before she leaves back to Colorado. And so I have three days with her, so I kind of wanted to plan out what we're gonna be doing, but maybe I can just do that with her tomorrow, like plan out stuff. Are you gonna give up coffee tomorrow? I guess so. Or just do black coffee? Probably just black coffee. Yeah, we're just gonna adjust it just a little bit. Us giving up coffee is like us giving up oxygen. It's just not gonna happen. She had her breakfast too, so she's in a better mood. Say hi, Fox. Hi, hi. Oh, hi. Oh, she's such a cutie. Cutie patootie. This was the best decision we ever made. Gotta go through the mail, get some packages. Why don't we just go through the mail together? Fox is just running around all throughout the house. AT&T. Jump. Jimmy Spencer and his kids. Cute. I haven't checked the mail since before the holidays, so. So cute. Together for 10 months nonstop and we're still smiling. The other moments are not pictured. <laughs> That's funny. Beverly Hills Sports Council, Hunter's Agency. And my good friend, Christina. Their family's like so picture perfect, it's ridiculous. Like, ridiculous, and they have two beautiful kids and the third one on the way, so cute. They're like literally a picturesque family with the most beautiful house. Oh, Carmen, cute. She was just funny. Happy everything, her and her cats. <laughs> Mallory Benham gets mail here, apparently. It's illegal to open up her mail, and plus it's from the plumbing company, so I'll just save this for her. She comes in tomorrow. Oh, the Ben and Mallory's family! So cute. Look how cute Mallory's little nibblings are. Look at this one. This one is like Mallory reincarnated. This one right here. And these are Mal's parents. <laughs> Mal. Mal and Dottie are like exactly the same. Here's Mal. 
Okay, look how cute she is. Her whole family's so cute. And then look at Dottie. But like, I just feel like this is like a little Mallory. Look how cute. Happy holidays. <laughs> This is hilarious, Hunter. That's hilarious. Alex Solomita's, my friend Alex Solomita, who I used to work with at IGN, bearded Mets bro. Oh. If you watch a lot of baseball, you probably saw his catch one time at a Mets game. It like went viral. And him and his girlfriend and his dog, this is so funny, did a Zoom card. I miss them so much. The Bear family. So this is my best friend from like three years old. Texas bound. They just moved to Texas to Houston. Don't mess with Texas. This is amazing. But yeah, they're moving to Texas, which is so exciting, so cute. This is Blay, and this is Pierce. This is my godson. He's eight. He's so cute. He's gonna go to the Hunter Pence Baseball Academy in Houston. And Hunter said he's gonna work with him on his swing, so he's very, very excited. And Blake wants to be an American Ninja Warrior. I've also known her forever, so. And we're still very, very close. Oh, Christopher Gay. The Gay family is Hunter's old, I always call him coach for back, like lack of a better word, but more like a mentor in baseball and kind of helps guide Hunter. Just kidding, this is a graduation announcement. I thought this was a Christmas card, but still, he's graduating. This is Chris Gay Jr. One more little package. This is like our mail. So everyone always asks me where they can send stuff, and I always just send them to BHSC, our, our agency, because it's just easier there. Lexi and Hunter, Forest Cat Woodworking. So these people, Merry Christmas, babies, bottle stoppers, and bottle opener for you guys, because we really appreciate your YouTube videos. Oh yeah! And all you do for charity. Josh is a public defender, and Lauren is a classical singer, but we do some word working in our free time. Both of us are big fans of coffee, cocktails, and baseball. Me too. So your videos are right up our alley. That's awesome. Keep up the great work. We look forward to what you guys do in the future. Sincerely, Josh and Lauren. So sweet. Oh, we needed a wine stopper, by the way, because if you guys catch Hunter's streams, you know he opens up a bottle of wine. Sometimes he doesn't finish it. But yeah, so check this out. It has a pineapple in it. So cute. I love it. We needed one of these. Bottle opener, ooh, so classy. A little orange and black in there. Ooh, you guys are really classing up this joint. It's crazy too, another orange and black woodworking bottle opener. If you guys wanna check them out, you can go to Forest Cat Woodworking on Instagram. So cute. We'll go play fetch in a little bit. Mommy's had her coffee now. She can function again. Go ahead, Fox. I wish I had two cameras all the time. One on me and one on Fox, just to show you guys how cute she is. Okie dokie. Oh, I know you guys are gonna wanna see this one. Coach Boach sent us a card. Coachy Boachy. Oh, they did a big family one. So cute. Looking good in retirement, looking good. I hope we look that good too. So Kevin Davidson, right here, used to play baseball with Hunter, I believe. And we went to his charity in Florida right before our engagement, and he was the one that helped us get engaged. So Kevin, his wife Blair, and their little boy Raleigh, look how handsome he is. He made it extra special for me, so that was really nice. Kevin, I'll, we will forever be indebted to you for that. Oh man, what is this? What is this, real stuff? This is like healthcare stuff for baseball. Oh, lucky day, oh, lucky day, I gotta go over stuff. This is like adulting stuff. This is like a Monday. Gotta go over this. This is like real, real adulting stuff. All right, now that I've done that, I'm gonna look through the CB2 <laughs> catalog. I think I'm gonna get these chairs. Because they spin, and I want spinny chairs there. I don't know, thinking about it. I'm gonna go watch some of the Sam Day girl, and then I'll see you guys in a little bit with what's next. Maybe some fetch with Fox. We'll see. All right, I'll see you in a little bit. Okay. All right, guys, so I'm showered. 
blow dry my hair. Now I am just boiling some chicken and rice for the foxinator because I hear that that's really good for her post-surgery. It's gentle on the tummy and it helps with healing. So I'm just gonna have it on hand for her just in case she doesn't want her normal food. I helped Hunter with his streaming setup, getting his lights all in order. Um, so he's streaming here. Look at this setup. Wowza, wowza. Some high five. Boom. We're so he's streaming, streaming here. Just Everyone, by his bars. What were Tell the chat hello. Okay, guys. I'll see you in a little bit. Gonna cook this chicken. Gonna make sandwiches for Hunter and I for dinner. Our last meal before the cleanse tomorrow. And then tomorrow, Foxy gets her, her thing done. See you guys in a few. All right, guys, so Hunter finished streaming. I made Foxy her food for post-surgery, just some chicken and rice, something very gentle on her tummy. Laundry, gonna tackle that tomorrow. Played with Foxy a little bit more in the hallway. <laughs> we played some fetch. What else did we do? That's How'd basically like it. How'd you like that? My new hydro so flag. tired, did you crush her? I crushed her, look at that, crush. You coming, Fox? Foxy, come. Good girl. Oh, it's time to go out. That's what we're waiting for. My alarm. You ready to take her out? It's time to take the box out. Everything hurts. Clean. I can't wait to start the detox. Clean tomorrow. starts tomorrow. Yeah, what do we eat in the morning? Do I, we... I have a headache. It's because I ate those stupid sugar cookies. I have a headache. My knee hurts. My hand hurts. Everything hurts. My hair hurts. I thought by taking a shower and like washing my hair, that I would feel better. I don't. I was just like so amped this morning. I was like, somebody stop me. Now I need somebody to stop me, you know? With the sugar cookies? With just like bad food. I need someone to Detox. put a leash on me and like yank at it every time. But it's like you have a, like a really fiber packed shake in the morning and then you have a fiber pack shake in the evening and then you have a really clean lunch so we're gonna do this for 21 days to hopefully get us healthy and vibrant and yeah hunter says it's a lot harder to be healthy when you're not playing baseball yeah it's easy to be disciplined when it's like towards a greater goal yeah. it's very hard when it's literally just for you i've been working on it my whole life it's, it's really a struggle effing hard the holidays and a pandemic it's just like too much i know fox but now i i like i'm starting to feel it you know i really just love her so much i just hope i just don't want anything to happen to her you guys can't understand her because it's a bond only we have but she told me she loved me too what's that we should wrap up this video <laughs> Perfect timing. <laughs> okay guys, until next time. <laughs> I'll see you guys in the chat. I'm trying to get a stream set up so I can start streaming as well. And until then you can watch Hunter on his stream at twitch.tv forward slash Hunter Pence. This vlog has gotten out of control. You've gotten out of control. <laughs> Somebody stop, stop it. it. <laughs> Nobody's gonna stop you. <laughs>